What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Big Sumble 422 coming with y'all with another video. Hey, I just want to say, just because y'all don't see my face, you feel me? It's all good. But um, we had a couple of, you know, breaking news that happened throughout the day with trade, with the trade deadline, you feel me? And I'm going to talk about a couple of more things into the video. Y'all know what to do, you feel me? Make sure y'all looking down in the description box. Make sure you check that out. Make sure you go ahead and check that out, you feel me? All my social medias that I be on. And make sure y'all go ahead. If y'all want if y'all want to hit my cash app, y'all can. It's going to be right down in the description box. If y'all want to hit it up, y'all can. You feel me? At the end of the day, um, y'all know what to talk about. You know what we about to talk about. Let's get to it, all right? Seeing you, Big Simple 422. Wee! Roll my intro. You know, it's about William Jackson the third. He got traded. You feel me? He got traded today. Um, I I wanted to give a, a update on that on my channel. You feel me? I, I I feel like that that needs to be talked about a little bit more. You feel me? Uh, William Jackson the third. He just didn't fit in this uh in the scheme more than anything. I I just feel like he just didn't fit fit what uh Jack Del Rio was trying to put out there for him. So at the end of the day, he got traded to the uh the to the Pittsburgh Steelers. I think we uh swap picks with a six a six round a six if we got a if we traded for a six to a seventh round pick, something like that. So um we we swap picks. So that that's something that I'm glad we did get a six round out of it, you feel me? So, you know, you, you never know. You never know what 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 you get out of get out of uh get out of William Jackson the third, you feel me? Um we we remember having the six round pick and we got Alpha Morris, you feel me? So I'm just saying. It, you just never know. And we got Cam Curl is in the seventh round. Who who would have thought that? You feel me? So those picks do matter at the end of the day, um, but you know you, you just get a hidden gem. You you be shocked. You feel me? So um, William Jackson the third, he he might fit just well over there with Pittsburgh. And one thing about that, I think he got some kind of connection with with over there with with Pittsburgh. So at the end of the day. Farewell to him, man. No, no harm over there. But when we when we pick up corners, it just don't turn out well in free agency. You feel me? Some something, something just don't click with that. You feel me? We just don't click in free agency when it comes down to corners. Okay, um, it, it's just you know with uh Norman. You feel me? I remember I still got his dag on, you know hoodie. You feel me? That that I still got. But at the end of the day, you know, he, he had his he had his moments, but he just has a lot of bad moments when he was playing with us. So at the end of the day, you know, corners just don't feel well in the in the uh in free agency for us. That's why I feel like we should draft draft our corners and go ahead go ahead and see what we got got in the draft. You feel me? Um, but I do trust Benjamin St. Juice. Um, Benjamin St. Juice, I know Fuller been getting burnt more than anything, burnt toasted. You feel me? So at the end of the day, I, I trust more in um, Benjamin St. Juice than any of these corners that we got on the team. And that's all it is to it. So I'm going to go ahead and talk about, you know, um, I'm going ahead and talk about Chase Young. 
Um, I, I feel like he sh this is something like source out there that he might play. He will play. But, you know, this is this could be breaking news. But at the end of the day, I, I, I will wait and see about Chase Young. You feel me? Because a lot of people look at Chase Young and, and say, man, why this man ain't starting? Why he's not on the field? I I understand, man. I, I I'm just like y'all. You feel me? So, I I want to see this man play. But if he if he got to get healthy to get strong, but if he's coming back, and I feel like he is, in this Vikings game, I feel like this will be a big statement game for Washington if they win against Vikings. So, um, at the end of the day, I I want to see what we can do. With with Chase Young, Chase Young don't have to come in there, you know, you know, just coming in there, feeling like he had to do it all. You feel me? Because the defensive line been playing well, they've been playing okay. You feel me? So it's nothing else. It's nothing else to talk about really after that. But at the end of the day, that's how I look at it. You feel me? That's how I look at it. At the end of the day, so. um after that, man, it, I, I want to talk about, you feel me, one more thing I'm definitely going to talk about. I got to give Teller Heineke his flowers, you feel me, more than anything. Um, shout out to Rio. Um, I, I, I think uh, I, I will, I'm a little criticism of Teller Heineke, too. Um, I, I know a lot of people is, but to all y'all Teller Heineke fans, you feel me, I got, I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm going to go along with it, you feel me? I'm a Washington fan from from the heart, you feel me? So, tell Heineke, he deserves his flowers. He's been playing. He's been playing. You already know what, he's, what he is, you feel me? You already know the tangibles. You already know what he's capable of. It's just something about Telly Heineke. He got those players. He, he, he got those players' number, you feel me? It's like... These are, he said, these guys want to play for Taylor Heineke. It's that, it's that plain and simple. You feel me? It seems like these guys want to rally around Taylor Heineke. So I'm going I'm to go along with it. You feel me? I feel like that will definitely make these players play harder because the way Taylor Heineke plays, I like the way he plays. Don't get me wrong. I love the way he plays when it comes down to his uh his attitude, the way he goes on the field, you feel me? He 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 take the next step. He keeps on playing. He keeps on playing. He keeps on getting up, even by a hard hit against the Colts on one drive. He he got hit and got straight back up. I said, man, this man is different. I I I feel like his arm gotten a little bit more stronger. Maybe I'm looking at it wrong, but I feel like. And shout out to King Ivo and me, it, it, King it, King Ivo 002. Man, I feel like I feel like Teller Heineke's arm gotten a little bit more stronger, just a little bit. What, what do y'all think in the comment section when it comes down to Teller Heineke's arm? I think it got a little bit more stronger. I'm not saying you know it got stronger out of this world that it can get get to the but it's decent enough now i feel like it's a little bit more decent so i guess he been to that weight room you know building building muscle trying to do what he had to do to get that arm straight so i i i i've been seeing some um good throws like when it comes down to you know especially in clutch clutch situations he he been throwing the ball with with efficiency in the clutch situations um, if that was Carson Wentz, we wouldn't have won. We wouldn't have won both of those games for real. Um, I, I'm I'm being I'm truly honest. If 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 Heineck, because especially for this offensive line, this offensive line been been putrid at at best. But what this offensive line does now, it helps out Teller Teller Heineke helps out the offensive line a lot more because. You know, Teller Heineke is mobile. He he gets out the pocket. He he makes something happen. You feel me? And you know, this offensive line don't have to do as much because he's juking defenders. He's trying to do what he have to do 
to make a play. So I love that we I, I think we should go ahead and roll with Tallahanneke the whole season and see what it goes through. And like I said, Tallahanneke, you you deserve what you deserve. You feel me? And at the end of the day, keep playing, bro. I'm 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 with it one hundred percent of the time. You feel me? So keep keep doing your thing, you feel me? Uh after that, tell her, honey, get, you know what I'm saying? So I, I got to do that for you, you feel me? So uh, <laughs> I just want to say, make sure y'all go ahead, you know, like, comment, and subscribe, and make sure you hit that notification bell. And until we meet again, hail to the commanders, and take command, and tell her, honey, keep doing your thing, you feel me? Um, I catch y'all later. I'm out. Peace.